What's happening everyone? Welcome back to another video. I want to address this question that came in. Um, gentleman was asking, what's the difference between IT and IS? So information technology and information systems. And so initially I, I responded uh, to his comment um, on the video, but uh, I thought that I'd, uh, I'd talk about it a little bit here on video because it's it's probably a pretty common question. Um, so basically, it goes like this. Information technology is a really broad term, okay? It basically is just the culmination of everything that has to do with, with technology for, for business, right? And so it's, it's this huge, it's, it, it's the industry, okay? It's the industry, that's the term for it. Um, and so then you kind of have to break down what's inside of information technology. So there's different sectors of information technology. And so everything that I talk about in my videos is information technology. That's the name of my channel, uh, Information Technology Q&A. Um, information systems falls within the information technology realm, if you will. And so it really depends on, you, you've got to be specific when you're asking a question about information technology, information systems, uh, because they're just such broad terms that they really don't mean anything. You know, it's just, it's just basically like a universe, okay? So information technology, information systems. Information systems, in the simplest way just means the systems that make up uh, the information technology world okay and that means it could be it could be hardware it could be software you know it's just it just depends on what aspect of information systems you're 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 talking about that you want to learn about um, but to just put together a video on the differences between the two can't really be done because again it's just it's those are just the terms for the industry and so if you've got specific questions like a lot of you ask uh, then I can then I can kind of distill down that information and make it easier for you to understand but um, there's no difference between IT and IS um, other than that uh, the the acronym Okay, so information technology and information systems. Um, so if someone starts talking to you about information technology or information systems, then, you know, you've, now that I've explained it to you, you've got, you've got more ammunition to say, okay, well, what exactly do you mean? What, what area of IT are you talking about? What, what part of information systems are you referring to? You know, are we talking about... Uh, data applications? Are we talking about you know hardware, uh, software? You know what what is it that that uh, that you're you're looking for within that that if that that realm of of uh, or that world? You know however you want to look at it. And so, anyways, that's that's my answer to you. I know it's really not not what you're looking for probably um, but like I said in my in my comment you know you need to be a little bit more specific about what it is you're looking for uh, in the world of information technology and information systems and then I can better assist you uh, based on that information so um, anyways uh, you know though there's probably people out there that, that will try to um, explain information technology and information systems and, and make it sound like it's this, that they're each, you know, different things and try to get all fancy. But if, if you've been watching my channel for any length of time and have seen my videos, you know, I'm not fancy. I... I try to make it as simple as possible for people to understand because it's such a a complicated industry, you know. 
and there's a lot of terminolo terminology thrown around, a lot of acronyms, and so people can get easily confused about what it is we do in the technology world. I mean, uh, I'm not an expert at it. I've been in it since, for 19 years. There's things that I still get confused about, but my purpose here is to help you better understand things at a at more of a micro level and kind of dumb it down in its basic form because people just make shit so they they make it so difficult because they they want to they want to act like they're you know that they're just they're they're special or you know they're big shots they understand you know it's just to me it's it's dumb you know it just just tell me the Tell me what it is exactly and in an understandable format, and, and that's what I want to know. And so that's what I try to teach everyone here on this channel is, is the, the simplicity of things as much as I can so that it's just easier to digest, okay? Anyways, that was kind of like a side rant, uh, but, but it was very, very relevant. So uh, anyways, let me know if you have questions. Uh, again, uh, specific things, just put them in the comments section, send me a private message on YouTube, however you want to do it, and uh, I'll do my best to answer what, I'm, what I feel comfortable answering, because, um, again, I don't know everything, and I won't, I won't attempt to answer stuff that I don't have an answer to, um, so I'll do my best to answer whatever it is that you ask. And so thank you so much for watching. If this is your first time here, if you feel inclined to push the red subscribe button, I'd appreciate it. And so uh, we'll talk to you on the next video. See ya.